Hi, my name is Tori. I'm an Everybody Active Coach for North Down and Ardsborough Council, funded by Sport NI. My job is to share special yoga. We've all been washing our hands, social distancing and staying at home to save lives. But while you are at home, we want you to feel less isolated and anxious too. So here is a short inclusive yoga session that will boost your mood and your immunity and help you feel better. Welcome to Yoga for Children and Families. This practice is suitable for children aged three upwards. Um, it's a short practice. If you have a yoga mat, that's great. If not, um, a clear space in your room. Carpet works well. If you have a hard floor, please make sure that socks are off to prevent slipping. And you can have a blanket or a towel handy um, for postures where we're having our knees on the ground or lying on our backs or our tummies for comfort. So let's get ready to start. Reach your arms up really tall and have a big stretch to the sides of your body. And then make your first finger and your thumb touch. So we're making circles with our fingers. Good. Keep your body really tall. And then we're going to bring our circles onto our eyes to make yoga glasses. You can see how the world looks through your yoga glasses. Can you turn your glasses upside down? Good. Let our glasses sit onto our knees. And let our backs be really nice and tall and straight. If it's comfortable, you can close your mouth and breathe in and out through your nose. We're going to start with singing OM, a big long sound, and we're going to see if we can notice if we feel the sound inside our body. So to help us notice, we're going to close our eyes. And let's take a nice deep breath in together. your body. You can open your eyes and you can point to the parts of the body where you felt the sound if you felt it anywhere. For me I felt it in my chest, I felt it in my throat and on my lips and tongue. Where did you feel it in your body? Put your hands on your tummy and notice how your tummy moves when you breathe. So you might feel your tummy moves your hands gently. So don't force your tummy to move. Just notice it if it moves maybe just a little bit. Good. And then let's say ha. Together, ha. Bring your hands onto your throat and say re. Re. Bring your hands on top of your head and say om. Om. Let's bring it together. Ha, re, om. And again, a little faster. Ha, re, om. Hari, om. We're going to sing Hari, om. So I'm going to make some movements with my body and sing the song one time. You watch me and then we'll do it two times together. You watching? Hari Om, Hari Om, Hari 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 Om. Okay, let's go together. Hari Om, Hari Om, Hari 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 Om. Good job. One more time. Hari Om, Hari Om, Hari 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 Om. Okay, my turn. Are you watching? Hari Om, Hari Om, Hari Hari Om. Okay, let's go. Hari Om, Hari Om, Hari Hari Om. And again. Hari Om, Hari Om. Job. My turn. Hari yum, Hari yum, Hari 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 yum. Let's go together. Hari yum, Hari yum, Hari 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 yum. One 
one more time. Hariyam, Hariyam, Hari, Hari, Hariyam. Good, and then give yourself a really big hug and say, I love me. Good job. And bring your arms down. My turn. Hariyam, Hariyam, Hari, Hariyam. Shall we try it together nice and slowly? Hariyam, Hariyam, Hari, Hariyam. Good job. So come and sit at the front of your mat or make sure you have some space behind you and hug your knees in tight. Give them a really big squeeze and then give your knees a kiss. If you can't reach them, you can blow them a kiss. Then let your back get nice and tall and keep your knees in close to your body, giving them a hug. Bring your toes up, and give your toes a wiggle. How much can you wiggle your toes? Bring your toes down and lift your heels up. Can you lift one foot up? Can you lift the other foot up? Can you say hello with your hands and your feet? And shall we rock goodbye? And come and sit back up into hello and rock goodbye. Up into hello, rocking backwards, goodbye. Last time, hello, goodbye, hello. And then reach your bottom back so your legs are straight out in front of you. Point your toes up to the sky. If you need to, you can keep a little tiny bend in your knees for mums and dads if you have a sore lower back. Help your back get nice and tall. Reach your arms up, really up towards the sky. We're gonna do a ha breath as we breathe out and reach down towards our toes. So let's do it together. So breathe in, reach up really, really tall and breathe out. Ha! <sighs> Good. And again, reach up really tall. And one more time, breathe in, reach up really tall. And then stay down and find your toes and give your toes a squeeze. So you might need to bring your knees up closer so you can reach your feet more easily. Squeeze the soles of your feet, the bottom of your feet. Rub your ankles. Can you find your ankles? Squeeze up your legs. Notice how they feel. Are they warm or cold? Pat your knees. Squeeze up your thighs and then pat your tummy and rub it in a circle. Bring your hands onto your back. Can you rub up and down your back? How does that feel in your body? Bring your arms forward, squeeze up one hand, squeeze past the wrist, past the elbow and all the way up into your shoulder. And give a nice squeeze in your shoulder. So especially mums and dads, sometimes we keep our worries in our shoulders. So if you find any worries, let's squeeze them out. Squeeze them all the way down your arm, shake them away. And let's do the other hand. Squeeze past the wrists, squeeze up past the elbow, and all the way up into your shoulder. Give a nice squeeze in there. You might notice different sensations in your body. Find any worries you might have, and let's squeeze them out. And shake them away. Lovely, let's come over onto our hands and knees. So if you or on hard floor without a yoga mat, you want to, might want to put a little blanket there if that's more comfortable. Good. Make your body nice and straight. So we've got straight arms under our shoulders, knees under our hips, into yoga table. Going to come into yoga cow. Head comes up and let your tummy come down. So keeping your arms nice and straight. Good. Shoulders close together. And then let's go into yoga cat. So I'll let our head come down. Look towards where your tummy button is between your legs as well. You can look through and then reach your back up towards the ceiling. Have a nice big stretch. Let's go back into yoga cow. Head comes up, tummy comes down. And let's stretch into a yoga cat. So reach your tummy button up towards your back and your head comes down. Lovely. Come back to a yoga table and let's reach one arm forward and the opposite leg back. So if it's your right arm forward, your left leg back. And 
reach them really far away from each other. Think about your tummy to help your balance. Nice deep breaths. And then bring your hand down, your knee down. And let's try the other side. So stretching your hand and your foot. Noticing your tummy, noticing your breath. And then bring your hand and your knee back down. Tuck your toes under. And let's come back into down dog. So lift your bottom up towards the sky. Push your hands into the mat. And sometimes dogs like to lift one leg in the air. Can you lift your leg up? So we see if you can kiss your knee. Can you bring your knee through and give it a kiss? If you don't give it a kiss, blow it a kiss. Reach it back up to the sky and bring that leg down. Let's try the same for the other foot. Lift up towards the sky, give your knee a kiss. Reach it back up towards the sky and then bring that foot down. Very nice. Then let your knees come down and come all the way down onto the mat. Let's come into Sphinx Pose. So your elbows are directly under your shoulders. Let your big toes touch and your legs relax. Look forward and let's see how big you can make your heart. So think about all those lovely rainbows that are in people's windows at the moment. Can you make your heart shine like a rainbow? Can you imagine the colours of the rainbow shining as you breathe? Make your heart really big. And can you smile? Good job. And then make a pillow with your hands. Let your head relax down. And notice your breath. So notice your tummy squash into the mat when you breathe. Notice your body feel heavy and relaxing. And then bend your knees and bring your feet towards your bottom. So we're going to see if we can reach back to hold onto our feet. So if you can't reach your feet, you can hold your hands here close to your feet and look forward and think about that lovely rainbow heart getting big. Otherwise, if you can reach your feet or your ankles, hold them tight, keep your knees close to each other, look forward, and then take a big breath, push your feet away from your head, look up and see, can you keep breathing? Notice what happens to your body when we breathe. Notice how it rocks back and forward on your tummy. And relax back down. And let your legs relax. Roll over onto your back. And reach your arms up above your head and stretch your toes and your fingers as far away from each other as you can. And then bring your knees into your tummy and give them a hug. Bring your head up towards your knees and give your knees a kiss. Or blow them a kiss. And you reach hold to the baby toe side of each foot. Let your head come back down and let your feet come up nice and wide towards the ceiling into happy baby pose. You can rock a little bit from side to side. Good. You can bring the soles of your feet together, point your toes up at the ceiling and you can look up between the space that you've made, a diamond space with your legs. If you want you can bring your arms to the inside and hold on to the baby toe side of your feet. Good job. And then slowly let your head come down. Let your knees come close together and let your feet come onto the ground. Bring your right knee in and give it a hug. And if it's comfortable, let your left leg go nice and straight. Feel your shoulders relax on the ground. So you can hold on in under your knee or you can hold on to the shin, whichever works best for your body, so that your shoulders feel nice and relaxed. And let's take a nice deep breath in and out through the nose, relaxing the body. And then let your hands come down and make a footprint on the ceiling, making that leg that's in the air nice and straight. Keep it coming down nice and slowly so it's next to your left leg. Does it feel maybe a little tiny bit longer? Let's do the left leg. Bring your left knee in and give it a hug. 
Again, you can hold under the knee if that works better for your body. So you're always feeling what feels good in your body. Bring a nice squeeze into the knee, towards the chest. Feel the shoulders on the ground relaxing. And then make a footprint on the ceiling with your left foot. Leg nice and straight and slowly bring it down. Good, bring both knees in together. Keep them close to your tummy. And bring your arms out to the side and let your knees go one way and your head goes the other. Feeling both shoulders relaxing on the ground. If one shoulder is off the ground, bring your knees down a little bit to help your shoulder come onto the ground and take some nice breaths and feel the breath in your tummy and chest. Then bring your head and your knees back to the center and then go the other way. So bring your knees go to one side, your head the other way from your knees. So we're twisting in our bodies. Feeling your breath in your tummy and chest. And then slowly bringing your knees and your head back to the center. Let your feet come onto the ground. And then let your legs come down. So have your legs wider than your hips, nice and wide. Have your body nice and relaxed with your palms facing up. You can look at the ceiling. And if it's comfortable, you can close your eyes and let your body get really, really soft. So we're not using any of our muscles. Feeling heavy, relaxed. Notice cooler air as you breathe in through your nose and warmer air as you breathe out. We're going to squeeze through the body. So lying nice and still, squeeze your toes and your feet in tight and relax. Squeeze your legs in really tight and relax. Squeeze your bottom in tight and relax. Squeeze your tummy and your chest in tight. And relax. Squeeze your fingers and your hands in tight. And relax. Squeeze your arms and your shoulders in tight. And relax. Squeeze your face in tight. Stretch it wide. And relax. And squeeze the whole body. Squeeze everything in really, really tight. And relax. And notice how relaxed feels in your body today. And now notice the sounds in your body. Maybe sounds in your tummy. The sound of your breath. Notice body feeling heavy, soft and relaxed. Breathing in peace, breathe out, relax. I breathe in peace and breathe out, relax. The body, relax. The breath relaxing, the mind relaxing. I am safe, I am comfortable, I am relaxed. Nice deep breath in, and as you breathe out, wiggle fingers and toes and slowly wake your body. You can have a nice big stretch, whatever feels right for you.
Slowly come up and sit with your eyes closed. And rub your hands together nice and fast. Get a nice warm feeling in the palms of your hands. And then place your palms over your eyes. Bring in a nice warmth. Slowly bring your hands down to your heart. And let's finish with a nice big stretch. You'll bring your arms out like we've just woken up in the morning. Stretch yourself really, really tall. Bring your arms up above your head. And we're going to finish with singing Om as we bring our hands down to our hearts. Om. Namaste. Thank you for sharing yoga with me today. Thanks for joining in and I hope you feel better. Keep joining in using the physical and well-being resources on Sport NI web pages and Facebook. So all of us at home can do sport and physical activity together to stay safe and strong and join the fight back. Bye.